My name is Michael Trout, and many of you may know me as the founder and the executive producer of the Southern Shakespeare Festival, which was an event that I started in 1994. You probably don't know that. And it wasn't until 1996, it took two years to actually get it going. Well, since then, I've worked on a number of startups and failed and um, spent time raising money and spent time as a everything from a health insurance salesman to a mortgage salesman and finally in 1994 I'm sorry 2004 I returned or I came to Japan and I decided that I would spend my time as a teacher and also explore ways to make education better so for a number of years, five years to be exact, I spent my time as a teacher. During that time, I started a project called Eduit, E-D-U-I-T dot O-R-G, which deals with autonomous learning. And autonomous learning is having a device like the one I'm talking to you interact with you in an intelligent way to keep learning objects coming at you, all right, and, and reacting to you. Well, after four years of trying to get this project going, I realized the problem isn't the idea because my idea I know is very good, all right? And everyone I talk to, I know, they were like, I love your idea, the idea of autonomous learning. However, the mechanism for launching ideas is systemically flawed. Systemically flawed means there are problems in the system of launching startups. Startups are an institutional vehicle that are governed by very few individuals, in, in fact, just like movie produ producing is. Um, you can't just go out there and make a movie. You can make a video, but you can't really make a movie because the funds and everything else is tied up. Things are changing, and something called crowdfunding is, is a very early development and offers great opportunity. I have launched something called the Foundup. A Foundup is kind of a collaborative version of the startup, and it treats the startup kind of um, as a stepping stone, where the startup is still an institution vehicle, meaning it's in, you have an incorporation, you have a board, all of that. That's institution. A Foundup is more of a collaborative vehicle where people come together because they like your idea, help work on the idea, and as a result, they get rewarded in something called Foundup dollars. Foundup dollars is our virtual money system that then can be used to spend to purchase equity when that Foundup actually becomes a startup in its private placement. Now, the good news is, even if that startup, Foundup, sorry, doesn't launch as a startup, it's not a big deal because the work and effort you put can actually be applied to a degree to other Foundups of ours. So what we're doing is mitigating risk. So instead of putting all your eggs in one basket, what we're saying is, hey, let's work as a community, let's get these projects up, and then let's succeed together. In essence, what I'm saying is, let's establish what I'm calling an open Google. If you think of Google, think of all the various projects that they have. They have AdVark, they have GVoice, they have uh, GTalk, they have um, um, GDocs, they have Android. Um, and a host of other, literally hundreds of projects that they're working on. Cisco's the same, Microsoft's the same. However, all of those are closed. They're closed collaborative frameworks. So what I'm saying is why don't we establish Foundup Corp as an open corporation where anyone can participate. We put certain safety measures in place to protect the institutions around it. Um, and I talk about those in my OIF manual, which I've linked here. However, the OIF manual is only available, the first part, which I call the uh, Foundup Manifesto, which talks about the vision and how everything kind of gels together. The manual itself is a step-by-step -step, um, roadmap for anyone to launch an idea using our open incubator. And it provides you everything you need to know First, you'll do this, then you'll do that. This is what you're gonna do with Gmail. This is what you're gonna do with um, um, LinkedIn and, and Facebook and so on. Most people are, 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 are using these social networks um, and are clueless on, on their power and opportunity to help validate. Now, I'm launching Foundups as a Foundup itself. And Foundups level up, and there's actually seven levels. When you reach level seven, you actually become a startup. A Foundup, in essence, we are, Foundups Corp is actually, we just finished level four. We're just finishing up our micro seed investment uh, round. And that's just a way to test. It's a validation, because we're not gonna go out there and raise 
500,000 or a million dollars if we can't even raise 50 from our friends, family, and associates out there, which we call micro seed investors. So good news is we're there. Um, we have a great board of individuals, great leadership involved, and I'm hoping you, one of my stakeholders from, from the Shakespeare Festival, who knows what I'm capable of doing, will get behind my project and want to invest and be part of it, okay? You've got to know me, okay? That's number one. And um, this isn't a public offering, so this isn't available to anyone. If you come to me and I don't know you, I'm going to say, sorry, I have to wait to our, for our IPO in order to invest. So I appreciate you taking the time to listen to this. My name is Michael Trout. I'm hoping to make the world a better place for entrepreneurs with our open incubator framework. Thanks.